introduction thank you so much for joining thank you and as you while might be traveling aapne dekha hoga ki hum jo hai celebration ki taraf badh rahe ji bilkul independence day aane ko hai and you know that our freedom fighters have sacrificed their lives so that we could celebrate independence day and on this note we are taking a huge honor today that we are here Get the logo. I shall call upon on stage Mr. Vivek Adrinyotri. Can we have a huge round of applause for him?
Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Vivek Ugnihotri, the man who gave us Kashmir Files. Good evening, everybody. I'm your co-host, Nicole Pereira. Next up, we have the poster launch. And we have none other than the director, Mr. Dhan Dinraj. Uh, Dinraj is, Mr. Dinraj is a very well-known tele Telugu writer who has written glorious films like Ishwar, where we have Prabhas, his debut movie, and many more other blockbusters where we have starring Benkatesh. So I would like to call on Mr. Dhinraj, please, to kindly come and launch the poster. Could we also have the cast of the movie? Do we have, could we have Niros Pucha, Shubhar Ranjan, Sonam, Bharpunga, Samara Sandhu, Piran Namgyal, and Rajeshwari Chakraborty on stage. Could I also have Mrs. Could we have Mr. Shankar on stage as well? Along with Mrs. Pallavi Joshi, could we also have Mr. Vivek Agnihotri to kindly come up and launch our poster for us? A huge round of applause, everybody. And here we present the new blood Bharatians. Huge round of applause, ladies and gentlemen, for the entire cast and crew who have worked day in and out. It's an at most proud moment for all of us. Could we have uh, Mrs. Pallavi Joshi to remain on stage for the... It is an utmost proud moment for us and we are extremely privileged that you're doing the teaser launch. Dear brothers and sisters, thank you all for coming, taking time to be here. Celebration of 75th year of winning over the evil. I will not call as Independence Day who gave us independence? We always have freedom, but we were told that we don't have freedom. We didn't have freedom at the time. So this is our 75th year of celebration of winning over the evil. So this movie, Bharatians, the title we thought to give it ourselves to rebrand as a Bharatians, not to be called as Indians, because that term was coined by Christopher Columbus a long time ago. And then coming to the whole theme, as you have seen in the teaser, we are hoping that you'll all appreciate a very common citizen who has a heart for the country, is a true soldier. Dinaraj, he is my childhood friend almost. I've known him from my early college days. <laughs> to describe him, I would tell him, I would say about him as one of the best human beings I have ever known. Very kind-hearted, caring person. He will not ask anything for himself. He just takes care of everyone around him. When we talked about the movie, he wasn't asking about how much remuneration he would be getting about it. He just wanted to make this movie. And he is extremely patriotic, and he is kind of role model to me. Dinraj, thank you for all hard work. And the cast members, I saw the movie three days ago without any DI or background music. I was so impressed and moved by the 
the performance of the actors and all the technical crew. I had tears in my eyes quite a few times. And uh, this is not because I'm biased with, because this is supposed to be our movie. I was watching as a third person, as a critic. I could not find any flaw at all. Excellent. I'm hoping that all the, most of the media and the people of our country will bless you all and bless us all. Thank you for all your hard work. <laughs> and uh, Mr. Agnihotri Pallaviji, thank you for being here. I just asked you to come over here. He came all the way from Goa. He was not here until today. And he's supposed to be going back and come back again on the 15th. He made time just for all of you and for all of us. Thank you for the blessings. <laughs> if I say or tell anything about Uwekji and Pallaviji, I do not think they need any introduction at all. Not only the whole country, most of the world knows very well about Vivekji. And my personal observation about Vivek and Pallaviji, they are down to earth. And how many directors you have seen with such an amount of success? Look that simple like him. Look around in the whole Bollywood, I'm asking you, the media. I think you know a better answer. You know the answer better. And to describe him, just to give him a, a name, a short name, I will call him as a modern Chhatrapati Shivaji. <laughs> Nothing less. 22nd century, uh, tw sorry, 21st century, 2022, modern Chhatrapati Shivaji. That amount of courage I have never seen any human being. When we were doing premieres for the Kashmir files in the US, I was told by many friends, supposed to be well-wishers, not to do the premieres in open theaters, openly publicizing everywhere, with so many death threats around us. And I saw Vivekji every day. He was in one city, 30 days, whole month of December. He was touring all over the country just by himself and uh, Pallaviji and their daughter, 22-year-old Malika. My God, these three are like soldiers. That charisma, that charisma and that courage is just uh, rem reminding all the time, not only the front soldiers in our country who protect us all the time, he was, his team was reminding me about Bhagat Singh and Chhatrapati Shivaji. Only those two names come into my mind when I see them. That's it. Nothing less. <laughs> Thank you again for coming all the way to bless us. And I will have Dean Raj to come and uh, tell his experience about the movie and about Vivekji. And uh, we welcome our request Vivekji and Pallaviji to talk to us also to bless us afterwards. Thank you. Vivekji and Pallaviji, <laughs> you are stars tonight. Thank you. Uh, actually, I'm not a good speaker. Shankar and we are, we know each other from our childhood. I have seen him when he's studying for MBBS training. Very dedicated person. I don't want to boast of him. I know him very well. He's very patriotic. And I want to tell one thing on stage regarding the Tashkent files. Choreography of dialogues. Dialogue choreography. Have you ever Legend the word. If you want to see, watch the Tashkent files. Fantastic dialogue narration. Fantastic. Very gripping story. Okay, <laughs> now I want to tell about my movie. I'm trying to direct a movie. I asked to Shankar, and he asked me only one question. Do you have any story 
relating to patriotism. I never wrote in that genre. <coughs> okay, with my experience, I said, okay, I can. Then I gave him just two synopsis, one page and one page. He selected one. And it started immediately. And my st star cast, I want to introduce them one by one. Samaira Sandhu, the Punjabi. Please come. She acted as Punjabi. There is no names in the script, only Punjabi. Next, Bengali. She is our Bengali. And next, Tripura. Indian Nepali. I am calling in the order of the <laughs> this time. Next, Mr. Bojpuri. Next, Mr. Telugu. And Marathi. Please come. <laughs> she is from Chandigarh. She is originally Punjabi. She is Bengali and Tripura. And she is Marathi. She is from Mumbai. Last one. He is from Sikkim. He is he born in Jharkhand, Shubranjan, and he is from Hyderabad, Telugu. Uh, and I want to introduce my music director, Mr. Satya Kashyap. We quarrel daily. Um, daily jagda karte hai. Saan ke baare mein. Sab, aisa nahi hona, aisa nahi hona. But finally, output will be the best. He gives good output. But every day we fight. <laughs> okay? Uh, I don't want to take much time. Actually, there are so many experiences, stories regarding our movie. We went to Sikkim, West Bengal, forest, so many places. I can't, uh, there is no time to tell all those things. Now, I want Mr. Vivek ji to give your speech and give them inspiration, youngsters. Please, Shankar, please come. Well, uh, Palaviji, Ajay, Jab he is talking. Thank you, thank you. Um, see, it's your film, it's your movement. You enjoy the glory. I don't have to say much, but one thing, brilliant job. Brilliant. And I'm telling you why. Okay, um, number one, I loved the way uh, you have kept the names. Okay, it's a very unique thing and I've always wondered if somebody has the guts to do something like this. I never had the guts to do something like this. This is a very brilliant thing and uh, the cast looks so fresh and nice and so passionate and so involved in the film, engaged in the film. You know, it looks like they are the characters and also the film looks like something I need to watch, I must watch. And uh, so it's a brilliant, brilliant effort and I know what it means to carry the burden of young cast on your shoulder, but you've got strong shoulders and they are brilliant people. And I hope uh, people would love this film. And I also love the name uh, Bharatians. That's a very, very uh, good name. Mm -hmm. And uh, the youth of India uh, today needs to get united, take us to the next level. And for that, we need to hear lots of young stories. And this is one of them. So I wish you guys all the best.
I, uh, to begin with, congratulations, all of you. Uh, the trailer looks brilliant, and as I immediately reacted after seeing the trailer, I can't wait to see the film. Uh, I'm extremely passionate about cinema. I've always been, because I started working as a child actor. So my entire life has only been about creativity and nothing else. Um, but before I speak more about the film, I would like to speak a little about Shankar. I'm so glad that you have made this movie, Shankar. He's, he's a very dear friend and one of the best human beings that we've come across. The way he worked um, to make the Kashmir Files premiere happen uh, in Raleigh, it was a great effort. And I, uh, Kashmir Files has set an example of how Indians can come together and make something happen. It truly became a people's movie. And I'm seeing the same reflection in this film as well. Because uh, as, as it's history now, the 36 organizations came together for the premiere of Kashmir Files. There was Sikh organization. There were uh, All India, uh, All American Jews organization. There was the Telangana Association. There was the Marathi Association. Similarly, you see the Punjabi, Bengali, Telugu, Marathi, you know, all, the, all of them coming together and fighting against uh, the evil and it really gladdens my heart that you know uh, a young india is coming emerging as a more powerful as a more patriotic india and the dreams that we've all seen are coming to fruition in this generation i wish you all the best may you all do very well and may you become big sh shining stars of the country but just as a senior actor there is one request from my side that a director always directs, an editor always edits, but an actor, when he becomes a star, sometimes forgets to act. Please don't do that. Remember that you're actors first, that's what a profession is called. So always be true to your profession and wish you all the best. And uh, you said that you're not very good at speaking. You don't have to be. You make the actors speak so well with your dialogues. <laughs> so all the best to all of you and congratulations. Can we have a huge round of applause for the entire team out here and our chief guest. I shall request you to please uh, be on the stage so that we can have a media one-on-one -on -one questions. Just for a little, just a little. You know the media and we want to hear more from you. <laughs> very, very curious. No, but this press conference is not about us. I just totally. came as a well-wisher. No. no, no, it's better I leave from here. Otherwise, I know what's going to happen. <laughs> no, no, I am an no, experienced no. person. I know what's... <laughs> media, media will uh, promise to stick with this subject. Achha, and, uh, I have, I have, I have, a, I have a suggestion. Aap ek sawal humse pooch lo. Uske baad we'll go and then you can continue with this. Is it okay? बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट काम था एंड यू नो आपको कैसे एहसास हुआ कि अब भारत के लिए कुछ करना चाहिए जब मैं बोलता हूँ भारतीय और मुझे कहीं समवेयर डाउन दान लाइन लगता है जब मैं विवेक सर की बात करता हूँ ही बिकम अ ब्रांड एम्बेसडर ऑफ इंडिया नाउ कि कुछ भी ऐसा जो हिंदुस्तान के लिए करना है वहाँ विवेक सर का होना बहुत जरूरी है ओके ओके माय क्वेश्चन टू यू इज यू नो एज यू आर ऑलरेडी बेस इन यूएस एंड यू आर हियर फॉर दिस फिल्म कॉल्ड भारतीय टेल एस हाउ दिस होल यू नो इनिशियट होल प्रोजेक्ट स्टार्टेड वेन यू थॉट स्टार्टेड वर्किंग ऑन फिल्म लाइक भारतीय टॉक अबाउट इंडिया इंडियंस so ji thank you for the wonderful question i am 57 year old 57 years of 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 a 57 years 30 years i've been in living in us so more time in my life so far i've been living in us but every day my heart belongs to bharat every single day my dna made up bharat my character made a bharat 
whatever I have achieved is because, just because of Bharat. This land, this air, this water made me who, what I am supposed to be today, what I'm doing today. So every cell in my body belongs to Bharat. I'm just living there in years, but from there, I, I want to do everything I can do, my, help my motherland to talk to younger generation, just to reiterate the message that the Bharat is the greatest country in the whole planet. Because of that, this media, the importance of media is if you write a book, it takes a lot of efforts to make the people read a book. If you same thing, if you make a movie or a documentary or any other media, it is much powerful, much more easy to get across to wider, wider audience all across the nation. So that is the reason to make a movie, something like this. And again, main inspiration is Vivek Ji from his, the way he works, the time he puts, all his thoughts are about Bharat. He is our main inspiration. And so is Dinaraj. He is extremely, ferociously patriotic, just like Vivek Ji. Thank you for your question. So what you, sir, to you. Me. Somebody like Vivek, sir, you know, Pallavi ma'am is here to support your film. What's your, what's your feeling? What do you want to say? I am proud of this movement. Because they are nationalists, they are patriots, they are uh, perfect for this moment. That's all. Vivek sir, Pallavi ma'am, Pallavi ma'am, आपसे जाना चाहूँगा मृग नैनी से लेकर यहाँ तक Vivek sir को भी किसी तारुफ की ज़रूरत नहीं है. One of the finest, you know, creative people on the rise. जब आपको बुलाया गया कि they want you to Vivek sir खास करके आपको जब मैं बोलता हूँ कि मुख्य अतिथि आप हैं और आप आप यहाँ हैं मौजूद हैं। What was your reaction जब मैं भारतीयांस की बात करता हूँ और मैं खास करके उस उस सब्जेक्ट की बात करता हूँ जब मैं कश्मीर फाइल्स की बात करता हूँ कि जहाँ स्टार कास्ट नहीं थी, जहाँ बड़े प्रोडक्शन हाउस नहीं थे, लेकिन वो फिल्म इतनी बड़ी कामयाब हुई। क्या फीलिंग आती है जब आपको इस तरह से कि आप आइए जब हम भारत की बात कर रहे हैं या हम इंडिया की बात कर रहे हैं या हम वतन परस्ती की बात कर रहे हैं तो वहाँ विवेक अग्निहोत्री का नाम अपने आप आता है। How is the feeling all together? Do you think somewhere down the line the responsibility on your shoulder goes up? No, I'm sorry. You asked me in Hindi, I'm going to answer in Hindi. I don't think like this. First of all, this is all in your mind that a film without star cast, what will happen? This is in your mind. You have been taught from your childhood by uh, media and all those people that without a star film can't work. But um, I know it for sure. I mean, there's evidence and there's a science to prove that films work only because of their story and their intent and never with the star power. So that is uh, first thing. Second thing is uh, when you say, okay, now you have more responsibility on your so, I don't think so, because it seems like a burden on you. Now, you have to behave on you, you have to talk about it. I was like that, but I was like that. I was like that, but I was like that. I was like that, but I was like that. Nothing has changed. And nothing will change, because I was like that responsible. So, I don't have any new thing that suddenly I made a patriotic film, and it's become a hit, and everyone said, hey, 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 now you have to do this. And I said, now I have to behave on you. I was like that, but I was like that, but I was like that, but I was like that. Uh, uh, Indian culture, Indian philosophy ke liye hai. and that's all I want to promote and uh, this film <coughs> after this I won't answer anything this film I want to tell you why it's a very very special film any film agar aap janna chahate hain ki uh, kisi film ko sirf trailer dekh ke ki ye kaisi hone wali hai the first thing you should judge is the intent and the sincerity and the honesty of the makers so about Shankar, I can say I've known him for a long time, is one of the most honest, most honest people I have met on in my entire life. His intention is so, so pure about it. And then um, he's got a wonderful crew and team and sincere people. It's an honest film. And a lot of people, everybody I know uh, complains ki why film industry is not changing. This is the change. This is how it is changing. एक आखरी सवाल विवेक सर आपने अभी ट्विटर का जिक्र किया अभी आपने ट्विटर का जिक्र किया और हम सब आपकी बेबाकी से जाहिर है सबको आपकी बेबाकी 
कितना मुनासिब और कितना सही है किसी फिल्म को बायकआउट करना क्योंकि किसी एक स्पेसिफिक बंदे के अलावा उसके अंदर टेक्नीशियन लाइटमैन स्पॉट बॉय बहुत लोगों का मेहनत होती है और किसी एक शख्स की वजह से यू नो इकोनॉमिकली कहीं सब कुछ हिल जाता है देखो ऐसा है कि इस बात को करना नहीं चाहिए अभी लेकिन बॉयकआउट करना एक इंडिविजुअल राइट है हम हर किसी हम फेमिनिस्ट राइट्स की बात करते हैं हम लोग आदिवासियों के राइट्स की बात करते हैं हम लोग जानवरों के राइट्स की बात करते हैं हम लोग डॉग्स के राइट की बात करते हैं कैट्स के सो आई थिंक बॉयकॉटिंग एनी थिंग इज एन इंडिविजुअल राइट इन अ मार्केट प्लेस बट द सेकेंड थिंग इज़ ये बॉयकॉट की सिचुएशन आई क्यों और तो ऐसा है कि जैसे कोई टूथपेस्ट बेचता है कोलगेट बेचता है फॉर एग्जाम्पल और कोलगेट बेचने वाला अपने ही जो कस्टमर से उनका मजाक उड़ाने लगे और बोले यारे जो लोग सुबह उठ के ब्रश में टूथपेस्ट लगा के करते हैं वो तो सब इडियट्स हैं तो आप क्या करेंगे कितने दिन तक कोलगेट खरीदेंगे सो so, ये थोड़ा इंट्रोस्पेक्ट करने की भी बात है कि आज क्या कारण है कि ये नौबत आई है एंड ऐसा मैं नहीं मानता हूँ बॉयकॉट बहुत फिल्मों का होता है कश्मीर uh, फाइल्स का तो पूरे के पूरे बॉलीवुड ने इको ने क्रिटिक्स ने मीडिया ने सब नहीं बॉयकआउट कर दिया था थिएटर्स ने एग्जिबिटर्स ने लेकिन अगर अगर सत्य में दम होती है और अगर आपकी फिल्म ऑनेस्ट है और सच्ची फिल्म है तो दुनिया की कोई ताकत उसे रोक भी नहीं सकती हेलो थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच एंड आई आई थिंक आई टेल यू व्हाट आई एम अ वेरी वेरी मैं अपने प्रोफेशन को लेके बहुत ऑनेस्ट आदमी हूँ एंड आई थिंक इट्स प्रोफेशनली इन फॉर मी टू हॉक द लाइम एट दिस पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम इट इज नॉट अबाउट इट्स अबाउट द फिल्म so please let's focus on the film sir last co- last question no, no, sir no, film sir film sir related hai sir sir film sir related hai last question hai some 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 time hai sir sir ek ek last question hai sir please aap rahiye sir sir kya aapko lagta hai ki sir ye film jo hai aajkal jo filme ban rahi hai nationalist film hi chal rahi hai aapko aisa lagta hai ki nationalist film hi chalengi yahan pe platform pe bollywood mein bhool bhulaiya to nationalist film nahi thi dangu bhai bhi nationalist film nahi thi dono chalengi nahi chali पुष्पा भी नेशनलिस्ट फिल्म नहीं थी केजीएफ भी नेशनलिस्ट फिल्म नहीं थी कैसे चली वो सारी फिल्में फिल्म अच्छी होनी चाहिए सब चलता है थैंक यू वेरी मच फैंटास्टिक पोस्टर आई लाइक you know the i uh, the saffron uh, top uh, then the blue and white uh, that's fantastic uh, wonderful creative uh, so my you. question to is to uh, is to the director uh, that uh, you know especially in the current uh, social uh, political environment that we find in today uh, so in the current uh, in uh, such environment what constitutes uh, bharatin according to you uh, so i like you to begin first and uh, you know any of the cast member can add to it you are talking about the title Bharatians, uh, yeah, uh, like looking at the political, social environment that is there in the country today, uh, what constitutes a Bharatian for you? Actually, producer told me to put this title as our uh, cinema for our cinema. Hmm? I'm sorry, I didn't get you, sir. The producer told you. This what is I'm actually producer idea. Okay. The Bharatians. Okay, okay. So why not we should call ourselves Bharatians? actually the india and the Indi- indians came from the greeks aryans it comes from the river indus they called as indians mm. but before that in puranas there is name for india that is bharat oh, yeah, that's correct why we are uh, following uh, greek people said that's why we are following why we have our own identity yeah. actually sir my question was that in the current social political environment no, that is uh, what constitutes a bharatian maybe uh, any one of the cast members can take it uh, sir please can you explain me again i said in the current social political environment that we live in today yeah what constitutes a bharatian for you for me bharatians is a word that combines us all that cleans all the boundaries which we all have created we which we all have been creating media has also been a part of it always so any issue when it comes up we divide it south north east west we have been doing that so in this movie we have brought everyone along 
And also, even if we go by the uh, genre of the film or the where it belongs, it belongs to India. It doesn't belong to Bollywood. It doesn't belong to Tollywood. It doesn't belong anywhere. It is belonging to India, Bharatians. And Bharat word has been used because we want that from now onwards, we should call ourselves as Bharatians, Bharat, not India, because India was name given by the Britishers. So you want, you wanted that concept to be clear? Oh, no, I just wanted in the sense that uh, in today's uh, in political social environment, so, uh, I think the early part of your answer is I think is good enough. Uh, I think the um, to begin with, I think I would like to give the example of the poem by uh, Rabindranath Tagore, where the mind is without fear. So, uh, according to me, I think uh, for me, uh, a Bharatian is someone, uh, an Indian is someone who is without. Uh, where the mind is without fear and where the, they can think freely. Because I think freedom of mind is also very important. So where we can think freely, where we can act, our, uh, where we can raise our voice freely, I think that is one of the main... Uh, um, a very good evening to one and all present here. I am Peden, and the name of my character in the movie is Tripura. And to answer your question, I think, um, well, Bharatians, the word is simply translated as Indian in English, right? So for me, I think being an Indian is somebody, we can be an Indian simply by just not littering around, you know? Just not littering around, boycotting plastic materials, you know, having no um, racism, all of that. I think sure. just very simple things, but these take, take us a very long way as an individual, as a Bharatian. That is my take. I think it's uh, looking at the teaser, it's fantastic. Uh, mm -hmm. There's a certain, uh, I would say a slight paradox in the terms right. of... Uh, Although on the one hand, it is called Bharatian, and uh, you know, if we have to call ourselves Bharatians, we have to relinquish our individual uh, identities, whether it's regional or religious. Uh, but uh, the characters are called, like, obviously, after region. Yes, we all given different names of different regions, but the movie has brought us together for a mission. Okay, okay. Yes, so we're all in this together. Great, great. Thank you. Uh, any questions? Next. My question is to the director. Mm. Uh, so, uh, talking about South films, uh, the South film is working a lot in Bollywood. So, how do you see to it, and what is your take on that? Actually, South Indians are doing good. I want to tell you the secret of why Bollywood movies are becoming flops. I need a few more minutes to explain this. In the beginning, Raj Kapoorji, Devanand sir, and Dilip Saab, they were doing story-based movies, all sufferings like that. And next came Aradhana movie with Raj Kanaji, and the trend changed. All romantic, everything. Again, the trend changed with Janjir. And Bachchan Saab ruled the Bollywood. Trend changes. Bollywood is not recognizing what happening. After Janjir, Hum Aphe Kon Dilwale Dulhenya Le Jayenge, 94-95 in the year. They came, and the whole Bollywood changed to the family love stories. After that, crossover films came into Bollywood. They just imitated Hollywood movies, and their audience detached themselves from the theaters with these crossover movies. After that, Bollywood slowly collapsed. They are detached from the theaters, and OTT also helped them to stay at home. What people want, I'm not telling this as a writer or a director. I'm inspired by so many Bollywood movies. Now people want what type of movies? 
बॉलीवुड शुड रिकॉग्नाइज दिस गदर एक प्रेम कथा अनिल शर्मा जी इज द डायरेक्टर सनी डियल हीरो वी वॉन्ट सच टाइप ऑफ मूवीज घायल राजकुमार संतोष जी का मूवी वी वॉन्ट दैट टाइप ऑफ मूवीज शोले देर इज नो सच मूवीज न बड़े एंड एवरीबडी इज ट्राइंग टू टेक हीरो इज अ मूवीज बट कैमरा एंगल्स एंड बैकग्राउंड म्यूजिक कॉन्ट मेक heroism they can't create heroism the heroism should be in the script itself watch kgf watch pushpa and watch our rajmouli ji ka har ek film the emotion rehta hai isme heroism with heroism with emotion bollywood ko main bol raha hu aisa pictures banao pehle subhash ji subhash gai ji kale charan vishwanath ऐसे पिक्चर्स है वो भी हम आपके फोन के बाद वो भी परदेश जैसा पिक्चर करना पड़ा है नो नाउ द ट्रेंड इज वी वॉन्ट फिल्म लाइक गदर एक प्रेम कथा दट इमोशनल हीरोइज्म एंड फर्स्ट फाइंड आउट राइटर्स लाइक सलीम सर जावेद सर दैट इज मोर इंपॉर्टेंट देन मेक मूवीज विथ emotional heroism that is the trend now okay thank you casting plays a very important part you know or may you know i i need i want to ask each and every one who's there on the dais or who's there on the stage please tell us something about us about yourself and i'll start with samaira and uh, you know uh, kgf h2 <laughs> uh, uh, please you know tell us something about yourself your journey in the industry how you got this uh, break in bharatians then i'll will move to samaira then you then other people on the dais start the cast how i got casted into bharatians something about yourself so my journey started from chandigarh to chennai i had not even seen mumbai i did my tamil film and uh, that was bhayam and then i uh, started getting some assignments here and i settled in mumbai to pahunchi to thi chandigarh se chennai safar mumbai mein shuru hua और फिर काफ़ी ऑडिशंस दिए काफ़ी कुछ किया लेकिन आ, फिर से फिर से वो चेन्नई ने मुंबई तक और मुंबई ने मुझे फिर से पंजाबी बना दिया क्योंकि <laughs> मुझे दीन राज सर मिल गए और उनको मुझ में वो जो पंजाब शायद पीछे छूट रहा था या मैं छोड़ आई थी शायद मुझे लग रहा था कि मैं टॉलीवुड एक्ट्रेस बन जाऊंगी एंड ही इज प्रेजेंटेड मी अगेन एज अ इंडियन फिगर दैट आई बिलोंग टू भारत और आई थिंक दैट्स अ वेरी बिग कॉम्प्लीमेंट इन इट सेल्फ दैट यू ट्रैवल सो फार फॉर योर करियर रोल्स ढूंढते हुए काम ढूंढते हुए लेकिन आपकी जो आइडेंटिटी है वो आपको रूटेड रखती है एंड यू गेट अ फिल्म लाइक दिस वेयर योर ओरिजिनैलिटी इज शोन and he shot it very raw that is the most beautiful part of it yeah i would like to give the mic to you okay hi good evening everyone sir first and foremost shankar sir thank you so much for f- producing this movie deenraj sir i'm always thankful to you for giving me such a great opportunity in this movie talking about the movie bharatians it was a great experience we have shot for 60 days in various locations of uh, india and my journey coming to my journey i was somewhere you know doing chota chota roles and uh, deen raj sir the man of who's actually picked me from nowhere and today i'm standing right here on it's all because of him and i i'm glad that you have given me this opportunity sir thank you so much a very good evening everyone thank you so much for gracing us with your presence uh, it's an honor and a privilege to be here beside all my cast and crew talking about me i am rajesh bidi chakraborty i am from sikkim so uh, i was crowned miss sikkim um, during 2018 and that's how i know her as well so what happened was 
uh, I was contacted about the role when I was sick, so I couldn't actually, you know, audition for the role. And again, 20 days later, I got a call from Pindi. I got I got a call from uh, someone else as well, and they wanted me to uh, sit for a screen test regarding this role. And then I did. I um, gave my audition, and that's how I was casted. And uh, it was a very good experience for me, because uh, also because it was shot in my hometown. So it was such. It was a very um, warm experience for me. And um, yeah, that's about it. If we can pass the mic. A very good evening once again. Um, I would like to start by thanking Mr. Dean Rat, sir, and Mr. Shankar Naidu, sir, for producing and making such an important movie. And I think it's the perfect time to release such a movie because we are all very patriotic right now. And, uh, you know, not many directors and writers gather up guts to make such a movie. And I think it's very important that all of us pay attention to this film intently. Also, as we all know, North, uh, the northeastern part, we don't get that much representation in the mainline movie stream. And so therefore, I feel very lucky and very grateful from the bottom of my heart. So um, talking a little bit about myself, I am Pede Nong Munamgal. I am former Miss Sikkim, Miss Northeast Diva, and Miss Supranational India. Um, yes, and uh, thank you very much. Don't you think it started by Anik? As you said, this Sorry. perception of... I'm talking to you. No. The perception, you know, when we talk about North East India. Why are shooting parallel? That's the reason I'm asking her. Sorry, That's what answer. was the question again? I said, do you think the profession, the perception already, you know, changed? It started with Aishman Kuranas, Anek. Uh, of course, I agree. But then I think we had shot way before that. And also, as we know, we are three Northeasterns in this film. I don't think anybody ever has guts to do that. And all three of us are the main cast members. Imagine how many guts, how much belief they've put in us. You know what I'm saying? It means you're saying Aishman came after you. It's a different story about belief. Sorry, I have no comments about that. Thank you. But uh, our genre is a bit different, no? Yeah. Right. Of course, we have a lot of regional films also working, but it doesn't get as big as a Bollywood movie. And also, I feel we don't have that many resources. Of course, I think that is your job as a media to, you know, inform them and talk to them about it as well. Right, right. Not many, but our film has been shot in Sikkim as well. So there I do see a change happening. Uh, Sonam, can you add to it, please? Yeah, so actually, like, um, just recently I did a, I had a part in uh, Mr. Sanjay Kapoor's The Last Star in Amazon. So I feel like slowly, like, you know, Northeast also, the actors, they're getting some work. But uh, as we, you were asking, like, you know, like, um, there's, there has been movies, like, you know, uh, ma'am also had, produced the Nepali movie. Uh, and uh, also, you're saying Anik, then Ahuni. So what I felt is like, when you add that, you has taken a lot of courage, you know, like we're all fresh faces, right? So uh, I feel um, with this movie, Bharatians, like I think um, we get more heard, I feel. We get more heard from the Northeast that we also have some talent. And we also would like to work. There's so, definitely yeah. talent. I think there's talent in yeah. every part of the country. Uh, like what I like about the south of India is, you know, obviously, you know, they basically have built their identity on their language. Yeah. And I feel like, you know, similar thing needs to happen with, uh, you know, whether it's northeast or other parts of India, uh, which are largely untapped. Uh, because I think because of the language barrier, you know, it always gets difficult. Like in Anek, uh, you know, they had uh, some good talent. Uh, but, you know, you could see that on the screen, you know, that the language was a barrier for them. And that's where I felt, you know, it's better, you know, that uh, you know, film producers invest uh, directly. You know, uh, make films. You know, of the region in their language, and uh, that is the way. You know, that's how it's going to grow. Because it was same for you know, even when Hindi cinema started, that's how they started. 
So it's important, you know, to, uh, you know, whether it's Northeast or other untapped region that uh, we get to see films in their language. Uh, so this was, this was just my uh, humble oh, perspective. Thank you. That. I will watch definitely, ma'am. Don't worry about that. I always look for good content. Uh, Dindraj ji, uh, Hello, sir. what is the re release plan and how many languages you want to release in the movie? Releasing time? Yeah. Do you want to talk about releasing time? Yeah. No. Hindi, Telugu, Tamil, Kannada, Malayalam. Total. Five languages. But we made it in Hindi and other languages will dub it. Hello. Sir, my question is for you. Sir, how difficult it is to make a movie in India? Because people have a heart and people have a heart in their country. So, do you want to say something about this? Please ask me again. How difficult it is to make a movie in India? Because people have a heart in their country. So, do you want to say something about this? It is easy or difficult to make a movie in India. We have committed to make a patriotic movie. So, we did it. It is not easy, it is not easy. We have to do it, we did it. We faced so many problems in so many locations. But we completed it. The cooperation of all cast and crew. Ask questions. Mr. Bhojpuri is ready to answer you. Ask him. Hello, sir. Sir, first of all, I want to answer one of your questions which you had asked. I didn't get the chance. The one with politics and social re re regarding our title, Bharatians. Yeah. What do you... Sir, according to me, according to this film, it's not according to me, it's according to this film. See, we have created different states and it has been going on. Right. So in this film, this is a very new concept which uh, uh, Sir has introduced. That's why we don't have our name and we are like, we are representing a state. We all, yeah, we are representing the language basically and we come together and we unite and we become together and that what is Bharatians is. Yes, sir. Uh, we'll, uh, you know, what kind of antagonist we'll get to see in the film? Who's the, the antagonist? Sir, sir, for that what you need to... What ideology does that antagonist represent? The, the ideology of the antagonist, if you want to know that, you have to watch the movie. Sure, sure, As I'll you can see, it's a war film. Yeah. So we are fighting. Yeah, we are fighting. And we all are fighting on day basis. We are, we are, we are fighting for our... Yeah. We all are fighting. <laughs> yeah, you will see that in the film. Sure, sure, I'll wait for it. It's Bharati answer. Any, any other question? And... Uh, yeah, yeah. Sir, sir, sir. Sir. Satya, sir. Please, sir. Uh, just a few seconds about Satya. You will, you will get to know the songs in the movie pretty soon. Satya, Kashyap, literally we have tortured him. Tortured in the sense. <laughs> he gave us the tunes. And we were, every single day, we were talking to him. We could do better better than this. But I mean, he gave us the best shots in the beginning itself. But we wanted the, the best of best. So literally, he came, he, he kind of uh, went through every song 20 different times. And uh, I must tell you, I think two days ago, I was running and as a routine in the 5 to 6 in the morning. I listened to the music. And his own music, I was re listening over and over, almost one hour, 10 minutes. Same song, over and over, one hour, 10 minutes. Just not because it's our movie, but the, the song is so marvelous. And I'm sure you will always, you all of, all of you will appreciate it. And uh, thank you, Satya, for all your hard work. Thank you, thank you, sir. You have given me such opportunity. I want to thank you and Dindra, sir. In this film, there are three songs. One song is that Madam Amruta Fadnavish Ji has sung. And the second song is Vishal Mishra. And the third song is Piyush Ambora. Three songs. That's it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much.
one last question. One last question. Sir, one last question. You can ask 10 questions. There is no hurry. No. Sir, to you only, to you only, sir. One last question, sir. Good evening to all. Or I will talk in Hindi because I am not fluent in English. Director Sir Samaira, you know, you have chosen me as a Marathi MLA play for me. And at that time, I am not confident, but they also had a trust, sir. They also had a trust. So, they relied on me that they would do it. I was there from Bombay, and I also had a lot of effort. It was my first time that they were so happy that they were so happy that they were so happy. They were so happy that 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 they were so happy. But I enjoyed thoroughly, and sir, you are really the God. You are so soft, 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 you are so soft. हम लोग एक परिवार है हमने साथ में और really हम लोग अलग-अलग स्टेट से हैं अलग-अलग कास्ट के हैं but हम लोग इतने खुश रहे हमने इतना एन्जॉय किया और we are really Bharatians I could say so 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 my question to you sir so you have told that you have you will be releasing the film in Hindi Tamil Telugu and Malayalam sir so why not why not in Sikkim and Assamese language sir why not in North Eastern language? Generally, in South India, most of the people can't understand Hindi. So we double it in their regional language. And rest of the, even in Sikkim, they talk Hindi. Ah, he talks Hindi. He is from Sikkim. So because the film is Bharti, and so do you? Uh, Actually, in the movie, this Bhojpuri talks Bhojpuri slang. हम कैसा हो कैसे हो बोलते हैं ना कैसन हो ऐसा बोलते हैं ऐसा लैंग्वेज है उनका और इनका ठीक बात और बंगाली वर्ड्स भी है पंजाबी वर्ड्स भी है ऐसा तेलुगु ऐसे वर्ड्स ओरिजिनल ऐसी है पूरा हिंदी में भी वो लोग ऐसी बात करते हैं वाहे गुरु पंजाबी बोलते हैं वाहे गुरु लाइक दैट Let us know who's playing who's uh, you know love interest in the film. Bharatians are तो प्यार नहीं करेंगे क्या? Actually प्यार जैसा है पर प्यार कब किसको किससे है उसके लिए आपको फिल्म देखनी पड़ेगी और और किस तरह का प्यार है वो भी आपको उसी में मालूम पड़ेगा इसमें तो बहुत ही अलग तरह का रोमांस है आपने कभी नहीं देखा होगा ऐसा <laughs> so I, I have one thing, I don't have any question because I'm so curious that you all belong to the different states. And I can visit many states, but I can't visit any states. I will go, of course. So if you have a dialogue in the language, if you have a dialogue that you like, you know, it was very loved. It was sounding so nice. So represent your state, there is no dialogue in your state. Please, one more time. Film? 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 We will make it completely. General, anything. Even if you want to ask you... Punjabi. Punjabi songs, you all listen to all. No, no. You are an actor. You will be very happy. Okay. Now, you are a Punjabi girl. You are a Punjabi girl. Today, we are all Punjabis. भारतीयंस हैं। ओए होए। क्या बात है? जय महाराष्ट्र, जय मराठा। जय महाराष्ट्र, मी मराठी आए, अन्य मलाम भारतीय होने से अभिमान आए। वाह, क्या बात है? Any, anything. You can just say that, you know, you're very proud to be associated with this film. Make this dialogue to translate. Today, we have to go to all of us. We are Bharatians. Hey, hey, what a story. Wow, so sweet. Our show is Bharatians. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, son, ba. Okay, ba. We are all Bharatians, ba. Oh! We are all Bharatians. 
Telugu, Telugu, it's time to Telugu. Father Telugu, Mother Canada, do you have any problem? Aha! Tagedele! Thank you all for coming. Thank you. Thank you all the media thank for joining all. us. Thank you. thank you and thank you the fantastic cast and crew available. Thank you so much. You guys are really so precious media wale. Thank you so much.